Hi hotties! In today's tutorial, I'll be showing you how to quickly create five different Pinterest-worthy blog post covers using Hotstock Canva templates. First things first, you'll want to download your templates from the membership website. Once you're logged in, click on the Member Hub and scroll down to Canva Templates. This will open up a PDF with all your monthly bonus graphics. Click on the link for the Pinterest graphics. This will take you to your Canva account and you'll just need to click on Use as a Template to get started. These graphics have been designed for you and are sized for Pinterest, so they're ready to be customized with your own brand colors, images, fonts, and copy. Before I get started, I'm going to create a palette of the colors I want to use throughout my designs. Navy, blush, and white. So they'll be saved in this Canva document and on hand so I can quickly choose these colors for any of the templates. Now that my colors are ready to go, I'm going to start changing this template first. I'm going to update the image first. And then the colors. Making sure that it all complements each other as a whole. I'm adding navy as my accent color while keeping the box where my text will go white to make sure that my text will be easy to read. Now I can go ahead and update the text with my blog post title while keeping in mind the type hierarchy. This template features a box at the top that's a great spot for the text you want to highlight. For this post, I'm highlighting that I'm sharing five different ways to do something. Numbers are great keywords, so I'll put that element in the top box. Next text box is the biggest and most prominent feature, so I'll put the main takeaway from my blog post here, making sure I'm using words that I've used throughout my blog post. Second element is the second biggest element on the cover, so I'll feature the second most important takeaway. And then finally, the last text box is the smallest of the title, so an element that is still important and specific to my topic. This is where you can feature copy related to what platform you're talking about, who your target audience might be, or a phrase related to what they'll learn in the end. Then finally, you'll always want to include your URL. For my first cover, I've used the title that I've created directly from my blog post. Lastly, I'll update the fonts with my own brand fonts, keeping in mind that you'll want to use two to three fonts max. Make sure that everything is emphasized the way you want it to be. If you need to adjust the sizing of anything, of course, feel free to do that. Make the template work for you. And now my blog post cover is finished and I'm ready to move on to the next one. I'll repeat all the steps that I did before for all the rest of the templates, but for the titles, I'll play around with different titles that feature keywords from my posts. So using different titles all related to your post will help you reach more audiences because different phrases will stand out to people for different reasons. So you want to target as many people as you can and then this way I can see which blog post covers perform the best on Pinterest and then tailor my future designs to mirror whatever is working best. Just remember to include keywords in every blog post title. Some of our templates are more general because we want to give you the freedom to add whatever works best for your business. So if a template doesn't have a title, then you can easily add your text over top. I'm also using different images for all of my five blog post covers to create variety and show Pinterest that I'm actually pinning new content to the platform. I'm choosing images either from one or two collections that all mesh well together and fit my branding or topic of the blog post.
Once I'm done customizing all of the five templates, I can download the files as PNGs and I'm ready with five different blog post covers to pin to Pinterest. The Hotstock templates make it so easy and quick to create multiple designs for a blog post and really take out a lot of the guesswork when it comes to creativity. They're all created to bring you quality design and with CEO in mind. They're super easy to customize and we hope that they make your Pinterest posting a hundred times easier. Keep in mind that you can also create your own custom templates and use them each time you have a blog post to create multiple Pinterest covers that you can upload to different boards on Pinterest in order to gain more traction on the platform.